We don't know how we're going to pay the bills and we could have maybe made other arrangements. Catherine Botsford is the co-owner of A Room in Paris, a home decor store here in Parkdale that narrowly survived the pandemic and soaring inflation. She estimates they lost about $5,000 in business over the weekend after these signs went up on Friday night. The yep. um, parking um, uh, restrictions were all the way to strong, which is significant. There's hundreds of small businesses trying to survive. We had a lot of client appointments set up, um, expecting a lot, and it shuts down your business. It's, it's zero. You can't operate because we can't even pull the car up to load items in, to bring them to customers. Customers can't park to come in. Um, and it's that way, you know, for every business along the street. According to shop owners along this stretch, the sudden parking ban came with no explanation and lasted all weekend. After many calls to the city, police and 311, Catherine learned that the road closures were to accommodate three street festivals in the area. We also reached out to the local councillor's office and received a statement saying police advised that the measures were necessary to manage traffic effectively during the festival period. Police have confirmed that the signs were removed by 7 o'clock. Monday morning. When it puts you out of business, that's a really big sacrifice. Catherine tells me it's been a very difficult four years for small businesses in Toronto and that this stretch of Queen Street lost 50% of its parking about a month ago for similar reasons to help with traffic flow impacted by the major construction near City Hall. And as she and fellow store owners struggle to thrive, this is her message to the city. Please take small businesses into consideration. At least let us know in advance so we can plan. Is there another way? Do we need to coordinate, you know, fun events in the city in a different way? We have a lot of construction going on. It's, I think, extraordinary for Toronto right now. Catherine says construction on the nearby Gardner Expressway is also significantly hampering business in the area. Her biggest concern now is that these weekend parking bans will be reoccurring throughout the summer festival season. It could also impact other neighborhoods. In Parkdale, Shauna Hunt, City News.